Hello everyone and welcome to another week of feedback for computer science in two years. I'm actually on week seven already, which uh, is kind of amazing to me. I can't believe the time has flown by as quickly as it did. It's almost two months, uh, but I think I'm progressing, right? There's been some ups and downs and uh, this week, if we look at our spreadsheet, has been a bit of an up, at least. As you can see, uh, this week I actually got to 24 and a half hours. I kind of missed a day. We had a bit of a family gathering and I couldn't make up for it. But it is looking better and I believe I can do even better in the week to come. It's good to keep a positive mindset and to keep moving forward. Even though you're not moving as fast as you thought, it's better if you keep going. So for this week's feedback, let's look at... Uh, Calculus first, why not? Since I completely missed it last week, I thought I would start this week off by giving you feedback on Calculus 1A. So I've actually completed Calculus 1A. I'm done, right? I did, I did the final problem sets, I did the exam, and it's over. Word of caution to you guys also doing this, um, in the last bit of the problem sets for Calculus 1A, remember I do the problem sets from open courseware, and the course technically is on open learning library. And uh, what that means is it doesn't, it doesn't really line up perfectly. And I noticed that when I was doing the last problem set and when I did the exam, there were some questions that involved the mean value theorem and then even some integration. And then I was on the struggle bus for a bit there. Uh, because I didn't really understand some of the stuff or it felt like I had to relearn it. I got through it slowly and maybe not convincingly, but I did sort of. And then when I started integration, the very first topic they, they did was mean value theorem. So yeah, that was a bit of a bummer. I could have gotten uh, through that much faster, I think, or at least much more convincingly than I did. Anyway, I'll get there now. I'm doing the mean value theorem properly, actually being presented. Somebody actually explained it to me. I didn't have to Google everything. I was convinced that I was taught this and I just forgot it completely. So I went and I Googled. I searched through my course notes trying to find out what the hell is this thing? Why am I blanking on it? And it turns out I never actually did it. But I'll never forget it now. That's for sure. So that's uh, calculus. In the next week, I'll be doing calculus 1B predominantly getting my integration on. So looking forward to that. Okay, now we can look at the programming. So you'll see on the timesheet that I did a bit of programming languages part A. This is still only the peer review. I did finish everything. I'm still done with everything. It's just, I don't really do the peer reviews properly. I kind of just, when I feel like it, I go do one and then I don't. And ach, it's a bit of a mess, but eventually I'll do all of them, right? And uh, I can progress then with the actual course content. I was able to do a bit of part B. Basically, I did the, the challenge problem for part B. That was it. Right, so not a lot happened in terms of coursework for this week in programming. However, for my project, I actually spent 14 and a half hours. The vast majority of this week was spent working on my project. And honestly, I wouldn't have spent it any other way. I am in love with doing a proper project. Yes, it's nice to do the coursework and learn the theory and all these complicated concepts about programming languages and idioms and all those things, but, Building something that works and that people actually need and can use, that's pretty nice as well. I really got into it and I'm kind of super motivated to finish this project by the end of next week. Well, not finish, but to have a release, let's say, a first released working application by the end of next week. Something that I can actually deploy, you know, online and uh, have people use. So that's, the, that's kind of the idea, to have that done. Maybe I won't do the deploying as well in the next week, but certainly have an application that would be deployable and then maybe uh, mess around with trying to deploy it for a weekend or another week or something like that because I have no idea how to do that. But, uh, you know, Google is a thing and I'm sure it's going to help me out quite a bit. As you might have realized, I'm pretty far along with this project and uh, you guys don't know anything about it, right? So what I'm thinking, 
possibly is that when I actually have something that is deployed and works fairly well, what I'll actually do is maybe make a separate video, not one of these feedback videos, but a separate video just running you guys through the code, maybe a little bit or through the functionality, just showing it off, right? Just showing everybody what it is I've actually been spending all this time in. And I'm pretty sure in the next week, I'll probably spend even more time on it, right? Because I'm, I'm kind of getting close to a deadline that I've set myself. So it's, it's my own deadline, but I'm really keen on meeting it. So I'm, I'm going to push. I'm going to push hard in the next week. And I think it, it would be fun if I can actually show you guys what I did. So I might make a different video. Um, I don't know when, but at some point to show off the application. It won't be in one of these feedback videos. Unfortunately, it'll just take too much time and I wanna keep these as short as possible. Speaking of keeping things short, that is it for this feedback. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for leaving comments, liking the videos, watching the videos. I'm looking forward to more of your feedback. If any of you are also doing OSU programming or just you know computer science in general, learning yourself programming, I'd like to hear from you. Um, how are you finding it? Do you guys have any cool projects that you're working on? Because uh, Honestly, cool projects, they really get you motivated. Uh, I would recommend getting yourself a nice project to work on. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.